Hello, I'm back. I did the hair, went purple. See, I did, it's all purple again. But right here, oh, I'm damn stubborn gray, so like I am. So yeah, that's done. Went to Walmart. Only one incident. And that was when I went around the corner to go down the aisle. Wasn't it? Don't worry, it wasn't an order picker this time. Go around the aisle and hear some big old huge man, 900 pounds, I don't know. I shouldn't be like that. That wasn't nice. I'm sorry. Anyhow, big old man and half as big a him woman just standing there in the middle. And I'm waiting. And I'm, I got my cart. I'm just standing there. And I'm waiting. And I'm waiting. Another woman went to come down the aisle and she turns to, uh-uh. So... I mean, I, better than a minute I'm standing there. Maybe two minutes. It was a long time. So finally I turn my cart around and they both look at me and I'm like, go talk some other fucking place. Quit blocking the aisle. She's like, oh, we're doing our shopping. What, were they going to take the whole goddamn aisle with them? You know, move over. Let people get by. Yeah, that was that was the only incident at Walmart. Um, I know I came back again with more than what I went for. Well, but it's okay. And I was really hesitating doing this hair. But I did it. I got a different brand this time. And it took a while, you know, to wash the remnants. I still got a few because you can see my scalp's dark. But I have scrubbed until my head is about to fall off. Um, hmm. Brain engage. Oh, it was easier, a little easier to rinse out, but... Um, stain. I had a big stain here. Couldn't get it off with anything. I got the Clorox clean up in a cotton ball. Had it on the inside of my arm. <clears throat> yeah, not little spots, big spots. You know, a couple spots on my face, but I was real careful. Um, so yeah, that's done again for a while. I got my apron order done. Hmm. What did I do? I, oh, earlier I was doing some stuff and I went outside. I still don't know what it was I was supposed to be doing. I went outside to bring the dogs in, decided to walk around and, you know, check my plants and everything, make sure they're okay. And I got to my flower garden in the corner. I don't know what happened. I started pulling the little trim edging uh, fencing, you know, little one out. And yeah, there was a couple weeds, so I pulled those out and gave him a water. He doesn't need it because it's going to rain, I'm sure. But yeah. And then I hosed off the bed. I forgot, you know, the squirrels are here today. This is a gun. Yeah, they're here today. So I'm like, useless as you know what on what. I am. That's okay. So anyhow, <clears throat> I got my market tomorrow on Sunday. Monday, I'm meeting my friend Laura, and we're going to Webster. And we're going to go to the office and see the woman that we know that works in the office to see if we can get his name so I can take it to the sheriff. Yeah. And then I'm going to make a report at my home share because there's three counties involved. Where Webster is is um I where I don't know. Uh but there's Citrus County involved, Hernando County. There's three counties. Yeah. 
Yeah. Well, I, I, I don't know, after he showed up at my place, I'm not. I don't know. Mm -mm. So I'm waiting for hubby to get home to see if he's taking me to dinner. Or if I make a dinner, because if I am, I bought already cooked chicken. Sure did. I'm just now, you know, getting to where I'm feeling a little better and my neck isn't hurt quite as much or as bad, you know, so um, that's been kicking my ass. So I said, you know what? I'm not cooking tonight. He won't complain. Hell, I can make him peanut butter jelly sandwich and give him some Cheez-Its and he'd be okay. He wouldn't complain at all. But yeah, I don't want to be out here cooking in a bunch of shit. I like to spend the evening with my husband. We very rarely, because I do my little business and he's got a side gig that, um, but he gets some big jobs um, that he does. Um, he builds batteries. Um, so we don't get a lot of time together. So maybe this evening, I don't know. But I did get the apron done. I haven't gotten not one thing printed out for those t-shirts yet. Not one. But it's okay. I work really good under pressure. Besides, I've got like three weeks to get them done. So once they're all printed, it's a piece of cake from there. But yeah. So yeah, the day went without any problems. You know, I come home and my grandson, I guess he forgot about our little tiff this morning. So I just let it go. You know, it's the right thing to do. Junior, come out of there. Come on. So, you know, I'm all about doing the right thing when I can. And then I can't. All right. Anyhow, I'm going to get off of here. I just want to come on and show you guys. See, my hair is all done. It looks good. Um, until I decide to get it all cut off and then I'll go back to blonde. And I'll do that one day and then I'll be pissed off at myself. Anyhow, sit down, have dinner with your family. Or go out to dinner with your family. Talk about events of the day, the week. Talk about things that bother you. Share your life. All of you, share your life. You know, you don't have to give everything, you know, but it makes people feel important if you tell them something, you know, that's special about you. So anyhow, let's keep moving. Let's keep going. Let's keep doing this. Because I'm going back to the why. To the water aerobics into the gym. That's what I'm going to do. I am physically fit enough to do that. So, have a wonderful night. Enjoy dinner. Um, I may be back later. I don't know. It depends on what happens here. All right, guys. See you later.